I, you know, everybody has been singing songs for the last five months now about how deep this AFC is since Russell Wilson arrived, Devontae Adams, so on and so forth. It's the best, most loaded NFL conference we've seen in 25, 30 years at least, right? I mean, there, there are some, there are eight or 10 teams legitimately that you could argue have a real shot at going to the Super Bowl. Buffalo Bills can go. Okay. Ravens and Bengals can go. Nobody in the AFC South can go. Oh, I disagree with you about that. You and don't think then, the Colts? You don't think the Colts with that defense, with that running game, with no. Matt Ryan not, not being with Matt playing Pryor the starting at left tackle? Nope. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, and then AFC West, I would say Chiefs and Broncos. The Las Vegas Raiders are not going to Super Bowl. The, the Chargers because are why so? Why 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 are you down on the Raiders? That's I, because I talk. I'm the opposite of you. I can talk myself into almost any team minus. The Texans. I don't think the Steelers are making a Super Bowl run. I wouldn't be surprised they get to the playoffs, though. And I guess the Bengals kind of went against this this year, in fairness. But I'm not a big believer in a team that hasn't won a playoff game in forever, all of a sudden going to the Super Bowl. So I know it happened this last year. I don't really almost every year, though, right? So, like, the Chargers are out. The Raiders are out. I believe there's usually a, like... A process to get there, right? Like I think that's true in the NBA, but even that's kind of gotten thrown out the window this postseason. I don't think that's true in the NFL. How many teams have we seen come out of nowhere and wind up in the Super Bowl? 